the question is find the properties of the complex given according to VBT okay according to VBT valence bond theory and the complex given is NIDMG hold twice this is the complex given to you. you have to find the properties of this complex based on VBT right before finding the properties we should know what is DMG so what is DMG it is dimethyl it is dimethyl glyoxine dimethyl glyoxine see the full form d m g dimethyl glyoxine correct ok i will draw here the structure first let us see the structure of dmg then we will find the properties based on vbt fine so the structure for dmg is c carbon attached to methyl group carbon attached to methyl group correct double bond n carbon attached to nitrogen with a double bond it is attached to oxygen and h why i am writing like this because just to show you that there are two acidic hydrogens two acidic hydrogen means it can be removed acidic hydrogen means which can be removed or donated correct now if it donates one charge sorry if it donates one hydrogen if one hydrogen is removed from here how what will be the charge it will get a minus one charge if one hydrogen is removed it gets a minus one charge correct and here for nitrogen there are lone pair of electrons also correct so this is the structure for dmg it has two acidic hydrogen that means it can be removed if it removes one hydrogen it gets minus one charge on removal of one any one hydrogen correct now what is the complex given to us ni dmg hold twice correct that is a complex given to us so two times dmg this is the dmg structure for, for uh, one dmg this is the structure for one dmg one more dmg we need so one more time i will draw this correct at that time i will remove one hydrogen from here okay so let's check now so it is the same structure like the mirror image so carbon ch3 carbon ch3 double bond n double bond n right it has electrons pair of electrons nitrogen is having right this nitrogen attached to oxygen ok so for this first dmg one dmg i have removed the hydrogen from here for the second dmg i am removing the hydrogen from top correct so here i will write full oxygen and hydrogen so here o and h will form a bond i will put as dotted lines i will put it as dotted lines correct so it forms hydrogen bond hydrogen forming a bond with oxygen that is hydrogen bond is formed hydrogen bond is formed correct now how many nitrogens are there 1 2 3 4 nitrogens all the nitrogens it will donate the electrons to the metal correct fine now why did i draw this because just to show that one dmg when i have drawn at first i drew only first one correct so one dmg it can donate how many electron pair two one and two how many donor sites it is having two right so each dmg it has two donor site 
each DMG, this is one DMG, it has two donor sites, one and two. See, two donor sites giving the electrons to metal. So, what is there in the question? Two DMG. So, two DMG will give how many donor sites? Four, correct? One, two, three, four, correct? So, how many orbitals, vacant orbitals do we need for the ligand DMG? Four we need, correct? So, four vacant orbitals are needed for DMG as when it is a ligand. So, let us now we will go to the VBT to find the properties of this complex. So, nickel organic configuration for nickel is 3D8, 4S0, correct. So, if you find for nickel 2 plus, if you find the oxidation state, it is nickel 2 plus organic configuration 3D8, correct, 3D8, 4S2 for nickel nickel 2 plus means it is organic configuration 3D8. Okay. Let us draw the orbitals here. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1 and 4 p, 3D, 4 s, 4 p, correct. How many electrons are there? 8 electrons, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 4 s, no electrons, 4p, no electrons. Now, check whether the ligand is a strong ligand or a weak ligand. Yes, ligand is a strong ligand. So, pairing will take place. DMG ligand is a strong ligand. So, pairing will take place. So, 1, 2, this is already paired up. This electrons will also get paired up. Right? Okay. Now, from the structure I told you how many DMG, how many donor sites? 4. So, we need 4 vacant orbitals. So, how will you take 4? 1 here, 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, what it is? D, S, P, 2. So, what is the hybridization here? D, S, P, 2 is the hybridization. Correct? D, S, P, 2 is the hybridization. See, why I took this example is just to explain you that vacant orbitals how many we need seeing this 2 dmg only dmg 2 it is there it does not mean that only 2 are required but each dmg it has 2 donor sites correct so 2 dmg will have how many donor sites 4 so we need 4 vacant orbitals correct so we are finding the hybridization dsp2 what is the value of magnetic moment here 0 because no unpaired electrons are there or the electrons are paired up. Spin multiplicity it is 1, if you want I will just do it, 2s plus 1 is the formula for spin multiplicity, no unpaired electrons, so s value is 0 plus 1, we get 1. Fourth one, it is diamagnetic in nature because all the electrons are paired up, correct. 